Hi, this is Ryan with RunBiz. Welcome to Web Tip Wednesday. Today we're continuing on in our Windows 10 series and looking at the Snip and Sketch tool. So this one's for all of you screenshotters out there who may already be familiar with the snipping tool. This is just Windows' new and improved version. So snipping tool should still be accessible on your PC, uh, but this is set to take its place eventually. So let's go ahead and get familiar with it. Now right out of the gate, one feature I really appreciate is when you use your keyboard shortcut, which is Windows Shift S, you can select the specific portion of your screen you'd like to capture. Once you've got your screenshot, it's automatically copied to your clipboard and available to paste. Now to access this feature manually, go ahead and click the start menu, type in snip and sketch, and now select the new button to start snipping. Snip and Sketch also allows you to do all of the markups your heart could desire. You've got a standard pen, pencil, and highlighter markup tools, but they've also included an eraser, a ruler to help with straight lines, and a cropping function to fine tune your parameters. Now finally, they've added a delay feature which allows you to snip with a 3 or 10 second delay. And you may wonder, how on earth is this helpful? It's not like we're taking selfies. But that delay function is actually incredibly useful when you're trying to capture a pop-up menu that you have to hover over for it to appear. So you can go ahead and set your 3 second or 10 second delay, hover over that menu, and then capture the shot you needed to capture. Overall, Windows has done a great job of improving an already useful feature. That concludes this week's web tip. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave those in the comments below and I'll do my best to get to all of them. For more web tips, go to www.run.biz and head to the Run Biz U section. Thanks and have a great week.